Hello and welcome to Living Life's Academy. Um, you may know me as Little Debbie's Life. I have shut down my channel and I am now at Living Life Academy. We have named our homeschool. This is going on our ninth year this year. So we are plucking through and I was gonna show you what we are gonna do this 2018-2019 homeschool year. Right here, we're gonna, this is the first read aloud that we're gonna do, Farmer Boy. It is an excellent book. We've read it before with My Father's World Adventures. The boy's book, of How to Be the Best at Everything. And it goes through and it tells you how to be the best at everything. I have a 13-year-old son who will be in seventh grade. I have a 10-year-old daughter who will be in sixth, but she will be 11. And I have a seven, going to be eight, very soon, going in second grade. It's just a sketch journal. I have him do some nature journaling. This is you can't sell your brother at the garage sale the kids book of values i found this at a garage sale it's typically where i like to find most of my stuff this year we have not found almost any garage sales and we have a four month old and i was hoping to get so many of his clothes at yard sales and we just can't find any i don't know if it's because it's so hot out or what but this is a christian liberty nature journal not journal reader second edition book one from christian liberty press I am going to go through this. We've never done a Christian Liberty Press. We are my father's world type people. So we're going to go ahead and give that a whirl. The U.S. History Cookbook. We are going to pluck through here and go through some recipes. I think our title of our school says that all living life. We are going to base our homeschool off from life, such as flowers. You find those in the woods, <laughs> in the yard and such. And this is an Osborne book, and it's beautifully illustrated, and I got it for a quarter at a yard sale. We are doing My Father's World Bible Reader for my um, second grader. She's been using this for quite a few years. I used it for my son and daughter, and she is practicing her reading, so that's why we're doing it. Osborne 100 Science Experiments. This is, I already got my bookmark there, what we'll be doing with um, My Father's World. So there's some beautiful illustrations in these type of books. What's happening to me, we're going to go through this since the kids are getting older and older all the time. Um, and it's pretty self-explanatory, beautiful illustrations. I thought some of them are inappropriate in what's happening to me, the Osborne book. But um, I'm going to do it with grace and uh, just make sure they know everything. 1850 to modern times my father's world we love this um this actually saved our homeschooling world recommended list for reading it has it in the back then it has lesson plans such as week 20 and um, we follow right along with that and then it also gives you like monday tuesday it's a great homeschool curriculum it's based on history speaking of history american history this goes with it um we're going to, beautiful illustrations again, reading. And uh, my second grader is also going to do Easy Peasy this year for her um, reading and math, language arts, science activities journal. So that's that. We got this from yard sale. And then my older kids are also going to do Lexia 2, 4, 5 through our library. This is another Christian Liberty Press illustrations. My Father's World does use these quite a bit. Path of Gold. We got this from church from our preacher's wife. It's an Abeka book. Try, try again. At first you don't succeed, try, try again. It's one of my favorites. And God We Trust. My Father's World. And then um, there's a little biography. I was born drawing fun, fun with pencils. Um, my daughter's been painting and really into stuff like that, so that's good. I was born historical sticker dolly dressing. I thought this would go with our year frame that we are learning about this year. And I looked on YouTube and I found like Housewives Day in the Life, like 1950s and such. I thought that's a good idea. So this year we're going to try something a little different and uh, like one day a week whatever period we're learning in our timeline we're going to pretend like we are living that era and see how that goes oh, but we will have running water and such so math six we are doing teaching textbooks this year um for the older kids i love them i 
think they're a great program. They also saved our math. And so that is our homeschool home. That is what we are doing this 2018-2019. Hope you enjoyed this, and please subscribe. Thank you. Bye.